August is very often a pivotal month for people. I often like to think of it as a sort of a point of reset where you think about how the year has been going so far, because very often towards the start of the year, what we're thinking is, right, summer's coming. What am I doing for the summer? Generally, there are obstructions to your goals. A lot of people take annual leave during this time or related to fitness, you know, they're on the holidays. They mightn't be sticking to their goals as much. They're not as important. Maybe they were trying to get lean for summer. They were trying to get in shape. But now as we get towards the second half of the year um, or the final parts of the year, the thought comes to, right, what did I say in January that I was going to do? What was I going to achieve this year? Now is the point at which you hit reset. Now is the point at which you say to yourself, right, summer's over. Time to buckle up, time to get back on the path and actually commit to what I said I was going to do. Because you can achieve so much more than you think you can. A year, so much can be done in a year. Uh, you know, there's the classic phrase that people often, you know, overestimate what they can do in a week and underestimate what they can do in a year or 10 years or whatever time frame people use. That absolutely applies. If you can apply yourself for one year to a goal, you'd be surprised how much you can achieve. So even those few months that are left this year, you can really start to turn things around. The year is not over, 2022 is not over. The thought of 2023 being so close is very scary for a lot of people. But if you set goals and they've been slipping away from you, now is time to hit reset. August is that month, hit reset, get after it. Hit me up if you need any help.